All right, well, it's ground down. It's on my chopping stump. I'm gonna let it sit out here in the Pennsylvania winter for two months, at which point we'll come back and see how well this stuff works. Hey guys, Ross with RV Tips and Travels. Recently, the folks at Bowshield reached out to partner with us to review some of their products. So I did my research. They market their products for RVs. The reviews online are great, but is this product as good as they say it is? And should you be keeping this in your RV maintenance kit? Today, we're going to find out. First, I wanna cover the multiple applications as they apply to an RV. I think the wide range of applications is actually the big selling point to this product, so I wanna cover that first. Bowshield T9 can be used on awning hardware. Steps, linkages, control cables, window tracks and shower doors, electrical connectors, wiring terminals, undercarriages, slide outs, jack stands, trailer hitches, tow bars, door locks, latches, and hinges, among other things. These are all areas you need to maintain anyway, but usually involve a couple different products like white lithium grease, dry lubes, degreasers, and rust preventatives. So if T9 works, it will replace multiple products, which will save you storage space, maintenance time, and money. So what is Bowshield T9? First, it's a penetrating lubricant, so it's designed to permeate deep inside metal crevices and push out moisture. Second, after a couple hours, it will dry to a waxy consistency that's waterproof. That is also safe on most paint, plastic, rubber, fiberglass, or vinyl surfaces, but without leaving a sticky film so it won't attract dirt, dust, or mud. And because it's waterproof, you can spray off dirt, dust, and mud around the areas it's applied without removing the lubricant. It's also non-conductive, so it won't cause short circuits, which means you could use it on electronics. It's perfect if you live in a coastal area and is highly effective for use in protecting all metals in salt water coastal areas. Also easy to remove, so you can use any solvent like mineral spirits, to remove any excess spray, or in recoating applications, T9 will actually dissolve itself, so you could just spray it on, wipe it off, and then recoat. And if you haven't figured it out yet, T9 can also be used on your tow vehicle in a multitude of applications as well as in your home. And one of the great things about Bowshield is they stand behind their product. If you find a better all-in-one solution, they will refund your purchase price. On a side note, if you're a little late to the game and have rust in certain areas, Bowshield makes a product called Rust Free. This is a solution you wipe on and off with a soft towel to remove light areas of rust or spray directly on and remove with a Scotch-Brite or scuff pad. After you are done cleaning up the rust, just spray T9 over it to protect that surface. If you want a heavy coat, just spray it on and let it dry. If you want a light coat, spray it on and just wipe it off. Bowshield will protect that area for months at a time. So I've had and used the product for about a month. I've applied it to my coupler locking lever, step hinge, step locking assembly, all my awning joints, my X chocks, stabilizer jacks, and my shackles and springs, just to name a few. Now, during the time I coated the RV, which was about a month ago, I also coated one side of a piece of bare steel and left the other side untreated. The steel is face up outside in the Pennsylvania winter. It's going to sit on my chopping stump untouched for two months. So we'll come back in two months and see how it turns out. We're going to post a follow-up video in about a month to show you what everything looks like that has been applied, including the bare metal that we coated in the backyard. So if you haven't yet, we hope you consider subscribing. Click that bell so you're notified when we release that follow-up video. In summary, after one month of use, as of now, I'm impressed. It's easy to apply, it's easy to wipe off the excess spray before it dries, and it's held up perfectly everywhere we've applied it so far. It only took me about 30 minutes to apply it to everything I could think of on our grand design, and I didn't have to switch between different lubricants. So if this holds up for three or four months at a time, I'm a happy camper. That was a good pun. I'll put links to these products down in the video description if you want to go ahead and check them out. I'll also put a link to the Bowshield website so you can check out their other products. For those of you already using Bowshield T9, let us know in the comments down below your experiences with it. If you enjoyed the video and appreciate the honesty, we hope you consider hitting that like button and subscribing to the channel. Keep an eye out for the follow-up video in about a month. Thanks for watching, and until next time, guys, happy camping. 
Recently, BowShield reached out to us to partner with them to do some blah, 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 blah. So what is BowShield T9? It's a Kerpro... It's also easy to remove, so you can use 